We have all seen photos of the Yiping and Loi Kertong Festival in Thailand. Glittering lanterns floating up to the sky, monks meditating at the Festival of Lights, hundreds of bamboo baskets alit with candles floating down the river, huge crowds, and of course, beautiful mayhem. The question you're asking yourself, is it worth it? Sadly, it's our last day in Chiang Rai. We are heading to the bus stop now to head back to Chiang Mai for the festival tonight. I'm so excited about the festival. We made it to the bus station. We have about 20 minutes to wait until our bus, and then we're on our way to Chiang Mai. First time we're on the bus, we're on the VIP, right? Yeah, and this is the express. So there's not a big difference. On the other one, it was two one configuration, so you have a little more leg room. These seats are a little skinnier, just two two instead, but it's still great. AC, lots of leg room. So nice. I think they're like seven bucks for a ticket. For only three and a half hours, this is gonna be a breeze. All right, here we go. Guess what I found in my pocket? Brand new chapstick. Those are rare commodities okay. nowadays. Bird speeds we live by. All right, getting off the bus. We finally made it to Chiang Mai. All right, we just got in our room. This is what $30 a night will get you during both the festivals here. Looks nice, it's cozy. Nice. And we got AC. So we're good, but we're back in Chiang Mai because the two big festivals of the year are going on right now. They are called Loi Katong and Yiping. We saw pictures of them before and it looked amazing. We were lucky enough to be here during that time. Yeah, and we said, okay, well, we have to come back to Chiang Mai so we can celebrate the festival and see all the beautiful lanterns going to the sky. We just found out from our Airbnb that the first ceremony was last night. So tonight, I think we're gonna head to Three Kings first, where they have a small lighting, they have all the lanterns lit up, it's supposed to be beautiful. Yeah, I thought we were late, like we were missing out, but turns out all the festivities happen over a period of four days. So we have tonight and we have tomorrow. We're just gonna go see what we find. Hi. These look cute. Yeah, I want the yellow one. So it's pretty cool, they have all these lanterns just going down both sides of the streets. As you can see, they're just everywhere. <laughs> he likes you. What did you find us? Uh, pad Thai omelet. So I think he's making the Pad Thai fresh to order and putting it in an omelet. Little Pad Thai omelet. We had street food in a while. It was really good. It is so good. I was so surprised. I was like, oh my gosh, I think I'm gonna go get another one. <laughs> so we found ourselves accidentally on Walking Street during the Sunday night market. We 
walk through Walking Street and we just got to the Three Kings Monument. It's nice and lively. So many places to shop and eat. I can't believe all the lanterns. It's kind of crazy. got back to our place. It was pretty cool on the way home. We ran into a parade. So that was another nice surprise. It was a little hectic. There were so many people by the Three Kings and just all by the night market. So it wore us out pretty quick. We really enjoyed our first night being back in Chiang Mai. Fast forward until tomorrow because we're doing it all again. This morning, whenever we woke up, we went downstairs to grab our breakfast and our Airbnb host, she is the sweetest. She made a bunch of croutons for everyone staying at the hotel. And since we were the first ones up, she let us go downstairs and pick out our croton that we wanted. I feel like I picked the prettiest one. I picked the one with the most purple flowers on it. It's so cute. I think I like this one. Because it has the most purple yeah. on it. This one? Okay. <laughs> Thank you so much. Thank you. Okay. Happy like a tongue. So Loi Kratong means releasing of the banana boat leaf and you make a wish and it floats down the river. And we're doing that tonight, so I'm so excited. Before we do that, we're actually heading to Wat Phao Tao. It's a temple located right in the old city and it looks so cool. They have a Buddhist ceremony where they light up the light. It's supposed to get super packed, so we're getting there a couple hours early to get a good yep. spot. So apparently it's like a fight for the front row kind of thing. That's not really my vibe. That's definitely his kind of vibe, but I'm here for your support, babe. Like I feel like I'm walking down the aisle or something, it's too cheesy. We have our spot. We didn't get here quite for that spot, but this is perfect for us. All these people and only an hour and a half to go still.
so cool. Yeah. It was a lot better than I thought. It was crazy crowded. You gotta kind of fight for your position. Yeah. And I'm really oh, somebody over. No, I'm, just <laughs> I'm really tired. That was a lot of standing. You can't move like to stretch out your legs or anything. But it's so beautiful. The young lungs put on a great show. Yeah. Oh, well, yeah. it was yeah, super touching. The music and I see all the lanterns in the sky over there. I feel like I'm missing out. She has some bad FOMO, so yeah. we're gonna follow those lanterns and just see where it takes us. Yeah, I wanna go get one put in the sky. Let's go. Oh, and our katong. We have to go put that. Oh in yeah, river. we can't forget about our boat. We got too much stuff to do. All right, let's go. Let's go. <laughs> I haven't seen this many people in one spot for such a long time. I love it though, it's so festive. We're still heading towards all those lights. You got two? You got two. Everybody's lighting off a balloon, the skies are beautiful. Such a cool experience. It off after we just did our first one. We want to do one more at least. We made our wish. It was actually special. Yeah, it was so cute. We had a local help us, which is really nice. A guy from Chiang Mai. That was so great, I could hang out here all night, but I think it's time to head back. We had such a great time. I feel so lucky to be here. I know. Yeah, we lucked out. We, we didn't plan this, and so perfect timing. It was. It was, it was very magical here. Tons of people, but it's so worth it. The Thai people were so sweet, too. The yeah, guy that helped us. us. With our lancer. And the people with the boats, too, kind of showed us what to do. But <sighs> such an awesome experience. Yeah. Sad it has to come to an end. But we might come back out for like, there's like the main parade tomorrow night, so you'll probably see that, too. But yeah, hope you enjoyed our video. We love being here. We definitely recommend it. Don't miss out. Thank you, my. Yeah.